My name is Jensen Brooksby. I'm 21 years old and I'm from Sacramento, California. I started playing at four years old. My parents had played tennis before, so they, they brought me into the sport and they were taught by the coach I'm actually with today. Stay physical, edge down. There it is, now step up and attack it. Being with the kids since he's seven years old, it's crazy. We know when to give each other space, we know when we can fight, we know when we can relax, and we're very in sync. That's how we practice is concentration. <laughs> when I'm playing well, I'm just really focused on wearing opponents down, getting a lot of balls, moving around, and just doing the best I can to attack their weaknesses. He's very calculated in what he does. He's not focused on, I'm just going to hit bigger than you, I'm going to be more athletic than you, I'm going to be stronger than you. He's playing tactical. It's just him trying to find every which way to win. Good, go, good, go. Oh! <laughs> It's amazing watching Brooksby play because he has these unconventional shots. I mean, most coaches, if you see a 12-year-old, 13-year-old play with a two-handed slice back in or a two-handed volley, they try and change that. I don't know what defines necessarily an unconventional game overall. Definitely the two-handed slice is a funny one, though, because um, I've had that from a young age, and obviously most guys have a one-handed slice, but it's something I feel like I've just had better control with on the shot. He got a hard time for it through the juniors quite a bit, but every time we changed it, we went back to the two because it's what worked. And then Jensen was always small, and then he got big. He just shot up. So now he's got a redirect game dealing with power in a big body. It's like a point guard kind of being small his whole life, learning all the skills, and then they get big and they're still playing like a point guard. My ranking to start out this year was 320 in the world, and this being my first full year as a pro, I haven't had a chance to show what I can do yet consistently at the highest levels. Each level, our goal was like, play the futures, prove it, play the challengers, prove it, go to the ATPs, prove it. I mean, he was ready. Well, welcome to the world's top 100 for the very first time, Jensen Brooksby. The 500 in DC making the semis that week gave me a lot of confidence going into the US Open. I was more excited, especially for this tournament, than the nervous, excited nerves, you could say. I knew that the crowds would be back and it makes it exciting for me. I love, I love atmospheres like that. Tell me he did not just do that. To play on Ash against Djokovic, you know, just an amazing experience. There's no better time to test your physicality, your mentality, than against the number one player. I thought I really executed well from the start of the match. I, I used the crowd well. I played the right tactics. Jensen Brooksby winning the first set 6-1. I was physically more struggling as the match went on, but even getting through two long four-setters and a five-setter before that match, and you know, getting through the fourth match too, is uh, you know, it's great progress for me. Djokovic. You could see the first thing he said to him, well played. First thing Djokovic said. We couldn't have done it better. Got to the round of 16, got to play Djokovic, got a lot of good wins. Information we needed to work on to come back home. Made a bit of a name for himself, which is always nice. Like, we feel like we're just getting started. I'm looking forward so much to learning more things about my game with Joe and also other players. Every level he goes to, he's having success. And I think that's the one thing probably that I've been impressed with is the speed of the success. I definitely think people didn't believe I could get to where I am. But, I mean, all you really have to do is you have to, like, believe in yourself and put in the work and know you're doing the right things. The rest will take care of itself, you know, because your, your mentality, how you approach things is more important than, than anything. 